Welcome to Take 5, your five-minute inspirational message from Solid Rock Drogheda. Simone Biles, the gymnast from the United States, uh, has been for years now a tremendously successful sportswoman, woman, winning, winning multiple uh, gold medals in Olympics and World Championships. Back in, 19, in 2021, in the Olympics, which were being held a year late, of course, because of the pandemic, in the Olympics in, uh, in Japan, uh, Simone Biles actually pulled out of several of the competitions. Uh, she'd said she, apparently she developed a condition called the twisties. And this is something that can happen to gymnasts that when they're hurtling through the air, they basically lose track. It's like losing your sense of direction, your sense of up or down, which to be honest at the speeds, I mean, I watch some of these gymnasts and the speeds in which they're twirling and, and somersaulting and, and everything else. I'm thinking, gosh, if you get that wrong, you could break your neck so easily. It must be terrifying to suffer from a condition like the twisties and she ended up dropping out uh, because of mental health problems. Now for some reason she came under attack from a lot of media pundits, uh, some of them people who couldn't climb a flight of stairs with getting out of breath called her weak and pathetic, uh, Piers Morgan called her a joke and she took time out for mental health problems. And actually at the time we recorded a take five in which we commended her for being honest enough to do that, to be able to say she was struggling with mental health issues. Well, a couple of weeks ago, she came back, made her return to the sport at the World Championships. And you know what? She ended up winning the gold medal for the best all round gymnast. She ended up win by the, the medals that she won in that championships, becoming the most decorated gymnast in history. And uh, she also completed a maneuver, which is so difficult, nobody had ever managed to do it before. And it has now been named after her. You know, Simone Biles is a tremendously courageous young woman. She doesn't deserve the abuse that she received back in 2021, because not only has she been a great sports person, she's overcome other obstacles. She's She's had a number of broken bones and serious injuries during her career. She was sexually abused by her coach and was able to testify and see him convicted and sent to prison. And then, of course, her well-publicized mental health problems. But she's come back from all of that magnificently. It's worth mentioning that Simone Biles over the years has spoken a number of times about her Christian faith, about how she trusts in God. It's God who enables her to do what she does in the sport of gymnastics. You know, mental health issues are real. It's a real problem. And uh, thank God we, we, it used to be that people were ashamed to speak about mental health problems. But now people are able to be more open about their mental health problems. And I thank God for people like Simone Biles who will speak out and give encouragement to others who are suffering from similar problems in their lives. But her comeback tells us that, you know what, even if you are struggling with mental health issues, God can bring you back to a place of victory once again. And Simone Biles is a fantastic illustration of this. Now, not everybody that suffers from mental health problems is going to be doing it in the glare of publicity as Simone Biles did. And uh, of course, most of us don't have the opportunity of coming back in an elite sport and, and having our vindication and having our recovery being quite as dramatic and as public as hers has been. In some sense, I guess that may, has made it harder for her, but she is to be commended for what she has done. And I just want to pray today for anyone who's struggling with depression, who's struggling with anxiety, who's struggling with fear, who's struggling with any kind of mental health issue. And I pray that today you will draw strength and you will draw courage and you will draw encouragement and you will draw hope from this Take 5. I pray God will strengthen you. I pray he will enable you to do things you've never done before. I pray God will bring you back from your problems stronger than you ever went into them in your life. In Jesus' name we pray. God bless you today. Join us again tomorrow for another Take 5, your five-minute inspirational message from Solid Rock Drogheda.